voor digitalisering van het onderwijssysteem en vergemakkelijking van afstandsonderwijs wordt gewerkt aan de opzet van een ICT-lab. De financiering wordt gedaan door de Islamic Development Bank als onderdeel van de Secondary and Technical Education Support Project, STES. Projectmanager van de STES, Anushka Abdulrahman, ziet de opzet van de ICT-lab als een belangrijk hulpmiddel voor het onderwijs. This is education lab, so will not only be the IT labs as we know, but they will also have um, projectors in the classrooms and another project activities also development of instructional videos. So we have a complete package um, to upgrade um, distance education within this project and the previous project, the DFAT project that is, has already been successfully finalized um, in the past year had uh, established a distance education hub uh, within PTC, the Polytechnical College, also funded by the Islamic Development Bank, and that should upgrade the um, distance education support. They should facilitate um, distance education at the schools. Tegen deze achtergrond voegde Muhammad Al Yasser, president van de Islamic Development Bank, ISDB, eraan toe dat investering in het medisch onderwijs ook prioriteit geniet vanwege zowel nationale als internationale voordelen. This country needs to continue what it is doing in terms of investing in knowledge. Finally, on the university, we are looking at the medical campus that we, we are looking at very seriously and we hope to be able to finance it because medical uh, uh, service can be a major sector in this country in terms of health tourism, in terms of uh, medical education, nursing education, medical technology specialties in your university and in, uh, here uh, that would be useful not only for your own here but also in the region. Het ligt in de bedoeling om deze projecten aan het eind van 2024 te hebben afgerond.